everyone, what's up, it's Nick here, and today I've got an unboxing for you guys of this little product that I bought right here. They are the Point Mobile Stereo Earwood Headset with Mic. So it's basically a uh, headphone set with a microphone built in that I just bought today. And I'm going to go ahead and unbox it for you guys because I'm bored and uh, I don't know why, I think I like doing these unboxing videos, so yeah. It's not really an expensive headset, it's just a cheap $24 headset and anything, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to unbox it for you guys and test it out with you guys here on camera. Oh, and I'm also using this video to test out this uh, new lighting system that I got in here because I just bought a ton of new lights in here, and so I know I've been complaining for a while about filming in here with this camera because my lighting was so terrible, so I actually went out and I bought some new lights, I bought this thing right here. I got my old lamps and I got a new light back there, so lots of new lighting. And so I thought, what better way to test my new lighting system in here than doing an unboxing. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and stop talking and just go ahead and get to the unboxing now. But let's go to the intro first. So yeah, see you guys in a bit. Okay guys, so this is another camera angle that I got here, pointing my camera at the ceiling because I'm so damn tall. So anyway, today I'm going to be unboxing the Points Mobile Stereo Earbud Headset with mic. So as you see here, it's from Point Mobile, and it's a little stereo headset with a microphone installed for it. So anyway, I picked this up by going to my uh, local Radio Shack, and it cost me around $24.99, so around $25. So anyway, let's go ahead and unbox this. So it's got a really nice plastic case around it. It's got some information here on the back, and it's got these two little plastic things here. So I was actually looking at this in the car on the ride over here, and it has these two little things here. Where all we do to unbox it is to just take the plastic out of the thing there, and then simply just slide it out. So here's the case, which we don't need anymore. And so now, here we have everything. We have the headphones with the microphone over there, and the little earphone adapter. So let's go ahead and take this out. I'm just gonna take the back off right there. That's a little nice flip open back. And here we have a nice little case right here. So if I go ahead and open up the case, it's probably empty. Oh, <laughs> something just dropped. So we actually have a little mini headphones adapter right here, which I did not know came with this thing. So that's a big surprise. So one of the problems is getting it out of the little plastic. So, yeah, so we just have to do that. So yeah, it actually comes with a thing like this, which is just a mini connector so you can connect it to a sort of mini headphone jack. So the big headphones go in there and the mini one goes in there. So, nice little adapter. And then also in here we have a little instruction manual thingy jigger saying plug this into your phone to that stuff, but uh, I'm not going to go over that for the sake of this. And so. Let's go over what the rest is in the box. So in here we have nothing but a little bit of plastic to go ahead and shield it from the back. And if we take out the headphones here, so let's just pry them out of the thing. We have our headphones. So let me just put this down in the end. And so, yeah, so they're really nice headphones. Uh, if you can't see what the fabric is like on them, it's actually not the normal plastic fabric like I see on most headphones. So let me just go ahead and grab my old headphones. So, uh, yeah, these here are my old headphones, which are tangled up in knots right at the moment. So, yeah, just to show you guys a comparison, as you can see here, the old headphones have sort of this uh, plastic black stuff that doesn't feel really good, but these headphones are made out of sort of a really nice feeling fabric, which is actually surprising because for $25 headsets this feels good. So they have the normal right and left earphone bud, and they're wrapped up here at the bottom, so let's just go ahead and unwrap that. And yeah, so whoa. These are pretty long headphones, so here's the 
uh, headphone jack at the bottom, and here is the little microphone thing right here. And so, yeah, so these are actually really nice headphones. Oh, and one more thing that I saw that came in the box was this, which is just a little clip. What you do is you attach the clip to the headphones, then you can go ahead and clip the clip onto your shirt so that they don't dangle around, because if you guys know about normal headphones and stuff, whenever you're listening to music, all your headphones like to dangle around. in the box you have the headphones you have your nice little case you have and all that good stuff so yeah I'll go ahead and show you some shots of that later so anyway yeah so now let's go ahead and actually do a test of these so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and skip to the next part so I can show you guys me testing these headphones out so yeah see you guys Earphones sound on my iPod, so I have a little trouble keeping them in my ears, but that's the same with all of your headphones, so you keep them in your ears. Uh, I have the uh, clip fastened securely, but I don't think I have it just the way I'd like to set on there, but I'm gonna go ahead and fix the clip later. So let's just go ahead and test out how these sound right now, so yeah. I make really weird looking faces when I sing. I mean, when I listen to music. It's like no happiness whatsoever, but I'm not talking about the sound, all right, so. The sound on there was really good, actually, so sorry if I made like weird, weird ass faces and I'm just in there like looking like a blank zombie whenever I listen to music, but the sound was actually good. It was actually way better than my old headphones. It has a lot of bass and a lot of uh, whatever the high pitch stuff is, so yeah, there's tremendous bass actually for $25 headphones, it's got awesome bass on it, so yeah, for $25 headphones, these things actually don't sound that bad, so anyway, that is how they sound when plugged into my iPod, so now let's test what happens when I plug them into a computer, so I'll plug them into my little laptop right here, that's the wrong mouse, so yeah, let's just go to iTunes and load up something, so yeah, let's play it. Oh, I didn't plug it in all the way. Maybe that's why I'm not hearing anything. <laughs> Alright, let's play. It's really loud, but lots and lots of bass, clear sound. say that is a really clear sound actually. It's a lot better than my old headphones. I still clipped in my shirt. So, so yeah, uh, let me just show you guys some of the old headphones that I've been using. Uh, these are my old headphones that I've been using for mobile devices such as my iPod as I showed you before. They have the little things that wrap around your ear and they don't really feel that good and well honestly these things have pretty good quality for $25 headphones. Way better than these, which were a $20 headphone, so $5 really does make a difference. And these were also $20 headphones that just go around your head like this. And uh, overall, these things have more bass than both of these, and they actually have really clear sound. And they're much louder than the both of these, too. So anyway, yeah, I'm really pleased with the performance of these headphones. So yeah, overall, those are pretty good headphones. So yeah, I'm going to go back and show you guys my final overview of the headphones right now.
Okay guys, so now we tested out how they sound. So anyway, now the only thing left to test is the microphone. So here I have a microphone which came with the headsets, and so now we're going to go ahead and test the audio quality of the microphone. So I have my iPod right here, and I'm just going to go ahead and launch up the voice memos application. So I'm going to go ahead and start recording with a voice memo. Hopefully I'll be able to layer that voice memo over this video recording right here so you guys will be able to hear what I'm saying. So yeah, let's just go ahead and do that right now. Okay everyone, so anyway, this is going to be a test of the recording in the uh, microphone right here. So anyway, I've got the microphone set up right here and hopefully when I lock my iPod, it will still record the audio. So anyway, yeah, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and just say that this is the quality. So it's actually pretty decent for a little headset microphone right here that's only $25. So anyway, it's pretty decent. As you can notice, I can go ahead and walk outside of the camera. And I can go ahead and walk in, and you guys can still hear me fine. I can walk around. And in fact, you know what? I can even go ahead, I can pan the camera towards the door. And I can go ahead and walk out the door. So yeah. See you guys and you guys can still hear what i'm saying without me even being in the room so i'm even in the little room that we have out there so i'm gonna go back inside my room before the battery dies and so yeah so anyway sorry you guys had to sit there and stare at my door but anyway that is how to go that is the sound of these headphones now they're coming out of my ear and the battery of my camera is running out so let's just go ahead and pan the camera back towards me so yeah anyway that is the audio quality hope you guys liked it i'm gonna go ahead and let's go ahead and give you guys my final overview of the headphones right now so yeah hope you guys like it okay guys so now it's time for me to go ahead and give my final review on this product so once again they are the point mobile earphone and microphone headphones they come in a very nice portable case and have a very nice sound so let's go ahead and get to the final rating so anyway, for portability, they definitely get a 10 out of 10 because they're very small, lightweight, and they come in a very nice package. For sound quality, they definitely have a nice 7 out of 10 compared to some of the high quality headphones. So for $25 headphones, they get a 7 out of 10 for sound quality because they're very loud and they have very nice sounding bass. So yeah, for $25 headphones, they're pretty good at sound in terms of sound. And for in terms of comfort, they're still comfortable, but uh, yeah, I have trouble keeping them in my ears, but anyway, that's what I have with all new headphones. I'm pretty sure once I get used to them, I won't have trouble keeping them in my ears anymore. But anyway, also with comfort, they have a very nice feeling felt, or whatever kind of material that is, that feels really good on your hands. So it's not like the normal plastic, it actually feels like very nice in the hands. So anyway, in terms of comfort, I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8 out of 10. And overall, I'm going to give it an overall rating of 8 out of 10. So anyway, for $25 headphones, they definitely get an 8 out of 10. And they are very good headphones, and I strongly recommend them. They're affordable, and you really do get a lot for $25 out of these. So yeah, for $25, they get an 8 out of 10. They're actually pretty decent, pretty good headphones. And so yeah. So anyway, I uh, forgot to go ahead and give you guys a rating on the microphone. The microphone, as you can tell, gets a 5 out of 10. But hey, it's a microphone, and it sounds better than some other microphones and it does have some good noise cancellation so yeah so overall rating 8 out of 10 they are the points mobile headset with uh, earphones and microphone you guys can go ahead and find them for $25 at your local Radio Shack store or sometimes at other places but I pick these up at Radio Shack and so yeah if you guys like these headphones then go ahead and go ahead and pick them up at Radio Shack so all right that's it for this review for more go ahead and visit my channel so anyway thanks a lot for watching guys and I'll see you guys next time